Hi, everybody. Hope, hope you're having a good Wednesday. I got Miss Dawn with me today. Um, we'll be on for a couple hours, probably till about 3 p.m. Eastern or so like that. I think. Is it, well, yeah, okay. I had to figure out what time it was over there. <laughs> I always talk in Eastern terms. It's just easier. Um, but yeah, we'll hang out a few minutes, wait till a few people show up. So we're going to show jewelry today. We'll have costume, possibly some sterling, maybe some stones. We'll mix it up. Let's see what you guys are, are into today. Um, if you are in the background just watching, come on in and say hello. Um, yeah. That's awesome. About <laughs> Today, I, I got to go to Walmart after the auction. Lovely. Go to the bank. And then I think I might hit up a thrift store today since Jose is off. We'll go see what we can find. You never know. Might find some some gold there. Might not. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just hey, so uh, came across a new store in my town. And I was like, oh, I think I'll be coming back. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's a hey, good one. <laughs> Exactly. Some days you go in, you don't find anything, and some days you walk out with a, a cart full of stuff, depending on what they got, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's right. All righty. We got four people watching. Come on in and say hello if you don't mind. That'd be great. If you don't want to, it's totally fine. We'll hang out for a minute or so, and uh, we'll, we'll get the auction on the road. Yeah, we don't have cooties <laughs> for anybody that's wondering. <laughs> Here they come. Hi, everybody. Can you see me? Now I can. You were frozen for a minute. I was like, <laughs> oh, no, my internet. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, cool. Hi, Anna. Hey, Judith. Hey, uh, T, what's happening? Thanks so much for being here, you guys. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's about that. Um, I just, uh, trying to lose weight. I went to Jack in the Box and got it breakfast burritos. I was so hungry. I'm like, man, good going, Tiffany. Like, <laughs> 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 nice job. Ah, hey, Lavetta. It was good, though. <laughs> oh, I bet. Yeah. <laughs> Frozen Anna and Elsa. <laughs> well, she went black and then I went black and I'm like, oh crap. <laughs> uh, let me go fix my curtain right quick before we get started, guys. I'm gonna close it a little bit. Maybe. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's good on this uh wacky Wednesday. Maybe it's gonna be a wacky Wednesday. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Wacky Wednesday, I like it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna get the show on the road. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna wing it. I got a uh, a bunch of stuff next to me, and I'm just gonna start pulling. No rhyme or reason for what I pull first. So, you ready to rock and roll, Don? I'm ready. Let's do it. All righty, I'll bring myself up here. Hey, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us. We're gonna do a two dollar start on this first item here. It is unmarked. It's got a silver tone lobster claw clasp. And, whoops. Hello. And an extender. It's really pretty. Excellent condition. It is acrylic. It's a nice statement piece, so you get the nice light, be light blue uh, faceted beads there. You get the darker blue, and then it goes to that grayish color. And you get the three strands. So even from back here, you can see it. It's not super heavy. It's got a little bit of weight on it because it's got a ton of beads, um, but no tarnishing, no beads are peeling or funny looking like that. And if there is no interest in something, guys, go ahead and put a pass in the chat so that way we can move it along. Hey, Carly Q. Thanks for being here. Carly Q, I'm going to send out your package today. Ask what else I got to do, too. I got to go to the post office uh, after this. I got mostly everybody shipped out except for... Um, Carly Q's, and then a few people that paid last night, and that's going to go out today. So any interest in this, looking for that $2 start, I'll give it a few more seconds. And if there is no interest, we're going to go five, four, three. Hey, Deanna. Uh, that, it is acrylic, yep. So we're going to go ahead and no sale it. If you do want it, Deanna, just uh, let me know. I'm going to put it off to the side for the moment. 
for the time being. Okay, oh, we'll do this one. We'll do a $2 start on this one as well. So this one is kind of long, so I'm going to go ahead and fold it over. Um, not fold it, but, you know, there we go. <laughs> and this one is Sweet Lola is what it is. It's kind of got, like that, got that bronze color um, extender and chain. I can get it to focus. Yeah, there we go. Sweet Lola. Get the lobster claw clasp. And you get these real pretty uh, glass beads going up over here that comes down to these. Oh my gosh, that's right. It's Veterans Day. Just kidding. It's going out tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. I mean, thank you. You saved me a trip. <laughs> yeah, quickly. I was going to go there too. So you saved us both. <laughs> yeah, I totally forgot about that. That's what uh, from working from home. I forget about the holidays sometimes. We <laughs> we got uh, Anna in at two. Thank you so much. It's in really really good condition. It does have some length to it. Sweet Lola. We got two dollars. Looking for three dollars. Any other interest in this? And if not, <laughs> we're gonna go once to Anna for two. Looking for that three dollar bid. We're going twice. Last well, call. I'm so glad you're here, Marion. Thank you. <laughs> We're sold to Anna for two dollars. Appreciate it. Two. Alrighty. And then for my third piece, let's do this one right here. We're gonna do a one dollar start. And this is a nice silver tone bracelet. Kind of got that garnet look to it. But it's not, but still super, super pretty. And it is flexible, so it makes it easy to go on your wrist like that. No tarnishing. It's just, it's beautiful. Fits nice and comfortably. There is no signature that I've noticed on it. There we go. We got Anna coming in at one. Thank you, thank you. We're looking for that $2 bid. And again, it is nice and flexible, just like that. Not going to break it. Oops. Okay. There we go. And T, would you like to come on in for two dollars on this? I got Anna at one. Alrighty. So we are gonna go once to Anna for a dollar, looking for that two dollar bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold to Anna for a dollar. Thank you, Anna. Appreciate it. All right, we're going to go on over to Dawn. Ready, girl? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right, guys. Uh, this first one is um, an orange, like rusty orange beaded necklace. We're going to start out at just $1. It's like a statement piece. Really kind of nice. Um, this is pretty weighty for what it is. But it's really nice. I love how the chain is on this one. Starting at just a dollar. Did you say that was glass or acrylic? I'm sorry. Um, I believe it's pretty weighty. Um, yeah, I believe these are glass. Real nice. All right, looking for that one dollar start on this. And if you don't like the style of the necklace, you could always take the. Uh, the beads off and repurpose it if you're into doing stuff like that. It does have an extender in the back about two inches. Okay, I'll go on to the next. The next one, we're going to start out at three. Uh, this is kind of a Y necklace here. It's got some enamel work. It's got this powder blue, this ivory, this green, and all the beads are faceted there and it's on this chunky chain it is marked and it is a Leah Sophia Leah Sophia that's really pretty so this is starting at three all right looking for that three dollar start nice Leah Sophia necklace you got the silver tone nice pendant at the bottom that's beautiful yeah, it's got some nice colors in that um, 
teardrop right there sort of almost has a labradorite look to it. Obviously, it's not a real stone, but the look. Any interest in this necklace? Looking for that $3 start or a pass, either or. And I love your nails. They're very, they're very cute. Oh, thank you. I got to go get mine done. <laughs> yeah, right. I, uh, I got to get them filled. And uh, the guy that did my nails, he uh, will go ahead and pass on that one. He said, um, we'll go ahead and think of a new plan next time. I said, sure thing. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Starting at a dollar on this one, this one is a little bit shorter piece. It's about 16 inches. What we have here is like a painted ball bead right there, kind of tribal looking in nature. And it's got these wooden chip pieces. These are not stone, they're wood. And also the he, she beads are wood also. It's got the um, kind of shepherd's hook back there, starting at a dollar. One dollar necklace. Looking for a male or a female, either or. Yeah, yeah, that's true too. Mm -hmm. It's got a funky yeah. design painted on there, pretty cool. Any interest in this, you guys? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass her. All righty. We're going to go ahead and move quick today. All right. I'll put it back on me. Hi, guys. So this one is new with tags. $2 start. And you get the lobster claw clasp. And you get the little heart uh, for the little dangly there. It's got a $28 price tag, but it does not say a brand or anything on it anywhere. But nonetheless, it's got the silver tone circles with the blue seed beads in between. Thank you, T. Yes, hit the thumbs up if you could. Thank you, guys. Very lightweight, but still very pretty. Looking for a $2 start on this. Try to bring it up a little bit closer so you can see it a bit better. There you go. No tarnishing, nothing like that. Any interest in this? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it along, no problem. And put that there. if you do decide that you want it, just let me know. Um, we'll do this one at a $2 start as well. Come on. Okay, you got that gunmetal gray color. Lobster claw clasp. Beautiful blue pendant. And that's the type of chain it is, or, you know, it's kind of stretchy in a way. It is metal, and then there's the pendant, and it's got the gunmetal gray chain right there as well. There's the back of it. There we go. Hey, Christy! Really, really pretty blue. That's a pretty decent size, too. Any interest in this? Looking for that $2 start. We got Carly Q in at 2. Thank you, thank you. We go. Two dollar start. We got Carly Q in at two. We're looking for that three dollar bid. Oh, there we go. And all the rhinestones uh, seem to be there. I'm double checking just to make sure. And we're good. And T, you would need to come in for three. We got Carly at two. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Ooh, damn it, I'm lagging. <laughs> I'm gonna love that lag. It gets us every time. Levetta comes in at three. We're looking for four. And again, I don't really, I forget what they call this. I think I remember right now, but it's one of those that kind of stretches a little bit. It can bend it, kind of like that. T is out. Uh, Carly Q, did you want to come on in for four or are you out? We got Levetta at a high bit of five. Uh, four, three. Brain cramp. Sorry. We got Carly Q at four. <laughs> <laughs> We're looking for five. Let me check 
on that lag. And Lavetta, did you want to come on in for five or are you out? Lavetta's in at five. We're looking for six. Yeah, it's not that bad on my end yet. <laughs> Focus. Come on. There it is. And what you thinking, Carly Q? Do you want to come in for six or are you out? Carly Q is out. All righty. We are going to go once to Lavetta for $5. Looking for that $6 bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And we're sold to Lavetta for 5 Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. And then let's do... No. Oh, not that one. Sorry. <laughs> um, we'll do this bracelet here. It is unmarked. We're just going to do a $1 start. Hey, Scoot Scoot. It's got the uh, fold-over clasp. There we go. Fold-over clasp. It's silver tone and gold tone. It is unmarked. There. Trying to get it to focus there. Looking for a $1 start. And I can get you a measurement on this as well. There we go. There's the back side of it. There's this side of it again. And you're looking at... About 7 inches long. So it is a, a bit of a smaller bracelet, but it is really pretty. It fits on my wrist. There we go. Any interest in this for a $1 start? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it. Ooh, no problem. Alrighty, that was my three, so we're going to go back over to Dawn. There. Alright, guys, I have a um, green and silver tone necklace here. This one is going to start out at three. Um, if you look at the pendant right there, right at the top, um, is a heart that holds the chain and then you've got like the green uh, crystals in there really pretty it does have an extender on it uh, this one's about three inches on that extender starting at three it's and got a nice thick uh, rope chain to it also and Christy uh, those ones are yellow uh, green green just kidding the green pendant, excuse me. <laughs> All right, looking for a three dollar start on this beautiful silver tone chain that the nice green stone pendant. Looks nice and fancy. Any interest in this for three dollars? All right. Oh. Christy, the uh, bracelet was gold tone and silver tone. Kitty. Yeah, there's another cat here. They, <laughs> they decided to join me, I guess. All right, uh, this next one, um, we're going to start out at three also. This is one of those um, kind of Y-shaped necklaces. And it's got like the big conchos on it. This is done in blue, all different medallions. The bottom pendant has, you know, the little bits down here. And once again, it's on a chunky chain. It does have an extender. So you can make this even longer. Hey, Laura. Hey. Oh. All right, y'all. $3 start on this. Nice, beautiful. Kind of southwestern, sort of, kind of. <laughs> kind of, yeah. It's really pretty. Any interest in this for $3? Okay. And then, 
Um, my last one, we're going to start out at a dollar. This is a stretch oh, oh, uh, panel brace. Laura, oh, okay. Drink? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Laura at three. We're looking for four. And guys, she ships the same way I do. She adds shipping at the end of the invoice. We're going to go once to Laura for $3. Looking for that $4 bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And you're sold to Laura for three. Thank you so much. And Laura is at Baymo, sorry. Okay. And for my last one, I have a stretch panel bracelet done in green starting at a dollar. Just a stretch here, uh, but it's really nice. The, the panels in there are uh, faceted. Really pretty. Oh, okay. I love this color green. It's really cool. One dollar start on this beautiful, beautiful color. We got Laura coming in at one. And do you ship to Canada, Don? Yep. I do ship uh, overseas. All right. We got Laura at one. We're looking for two. So we're going to go once to Laura for a dollar, looking for two dollars. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning, and we're sold to Laura for a dollar. Congratulations. Thank you so much. All and that's right. my three. Cool dude. Hey, guys. We're going to do a $1 start on this. I got a bracelet. It's got the faux pearls. And this is all attached. It comes as one. You get the faux pearls. You get the prong set uh, blue, light blue beads there. And then you get the gold tone, like rollover bracelets here. So five strands, one dollar starts in really good condition. I do not see a. It is a bit stretchy as well, so it'll make it easier to go on your wrist like that. There we go. One dollar start on this guy. Hey, Lena. Happy Wednesday. Come on. There we go. Any interest in this? Looking for a $1 start. And if not, I'll go ahead and put it over to the side. Not a problem. There's that. So we'll do a no sale on this guy here. And then, what are you? Oh, there it is. So this one is silver tone. It is unmarked. Let's do a $1 start on this too. Happy Veterans Day. That's right. Doing good so far. Hey, uh, Jonathan there so let me just fix this up i got it all messed up a little bit yeah that's right you get the idea you get the lobster claw clasp you get the little uh squares here you got some that has that matte finish and some that have that nice shiny finish it's all silver tone looking for a one dollar star on this guy no oh, that's an awesome one it's cute it's nice and simple It'll match a lot of things and lightweight, you get the matte and the glossy finish. We got Christy in at one. We're looking for two. Thank you guys for hanging out with us, with us this afternoon. Any other interest in this guy right here? And if not, we're going to go once to Christy for a dollar. Looking for that $2 bid. Going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold to Chrissy for a dollar. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oopsies. Hello. And then for my third piece, we are going to do these really pretty earrings. We're going to do a $2 start on them. 
Okay. Nice silver tone. You get the least there. You got this. It kind of looks like lava rock, but it's blue, so I don't know if that would still be lava rock. So anyway, there's that. There's no tarnishing on the um on the hooks or anything like that. So I don't know if they were ever worn, if they were made and this put on the card, and that was that was the end of it there. If we can get it to focus again. Come on. There we go. We got Laura in at two. We're looking for three. Pretty decent size. Um, I'll get you a measurement on it. You're looking at Mm, three and a half inches long. Well, we got two dollars looking for that three dollar bid. Any other interest in these? And if not, we're gonna go once to Laura for two or going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold to Laura for two dollars. Thank you so much, Laura. Appreciate it. Alrighty. And we're gonna go back over to Don. Here we go. Woo. All right, I have an all glass and metal uh, bracelet with a toggle. I'm starting out at three on this one. This one is just gorgeous. We got some uh, Murano glass work going here. We also have some art glass in there. Really pretty with like flowers and um, just uh, some of these have like um, different prints on each of them. You've got one that looks like an amethyst color. Kind of like blown glass there. And I love the toggle on this one. It's oh, got the rose. This is eight inches, by the way, eight inches on this bracelet. I don't know if I said that. Shame on me if I didn't, but <laughs> it is yeah. eight inches. Hi, it's Eric. Beautiful. And Lena says, hi, Don. Please to meet you in person. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's great. It's great to see you, Lena. And then uh, we got Laura coming in at three. We're all looking for four. Mm -hmm. Oops. I got $3 looking for $4. Any other interest in this? And if not, we're going to go once to Laura for three. Hey, Alice. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And you're sold to Laura for $3. Congratulations. Thank you so much. All righty. Uh, the next two are going to be earrings. And uh, I'm just going to start these out at $2. Uh, we have these big silver tone hoops with... Um, the little ball beads and the balls have uh, like uh, crystals in them. And you got the like shepherd's hook back there with the rubber backs. I just put them on cardstock just so I could hold on to them better, if nothing else. That's pretty. Uh, yeah, these are cute. Let me see if I can put them. If you can see them better. Nice silver tone. Looking for that $2 start. Any interest in these? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it. Okay. And uh, the next earrings I have, we'll just start out at a dollar. Um, these are little uh, gold tone. Uh, metal earrings. They have two like stars on them, one at the top with a crystal in it and one at the bottom. And it's on a piece of uh, shell disc right mm -hmm. there, like mother of pearl disc. And we're just going to start out at a dollar on this one. Those are nice, pretty earrings, you guys. Little danglies. Uh, they're not as long as mine. <laughs> I have real long ones on. I have the chili peppers on right now. <laughs> Looking for that $1 start on these nice gold tone. Get the little rhinestones in there. Really pretty. All right. That's my three. All righty. 
No Sam. Back over to oh, uh, Laura came in at one. All righty. <laughs> so we'll call it just in case there's a little bit of a lag. We're gonna go once to Laura for a dollar, looking for that two dollar bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning, and we're sold to Laura for a dollar. Congratulations. Thank you so much. All righty. Hey, uh, um, this one is this one's Aaliyah Sophia. Uh, am I putting it on the right way? I am. <laughs> okay. I know Lena. Yeah, she's she's getting a little bit better every day, and hopefully she keeps it up and she can go uh, back home. That'd be nice. So you got the lobster claw clasp, and I got it all tangled up. It does have an extender. Oh, there it is. It's not that bad. <laughs> very, very clean necklace. Hey, Maury. And this is a nice Leah Sophia necklace. It's got those uh, that that nice texture on all these um, circles here. And the back side got that brush look. It also has a Leah Sophia on the bottom of the last pendant there. We got Carly Q coming in at two. We're looking for three. And hello to anybody that I may have missed. Really appreciate it, you guys. There we go. We got two dollars looking for three dollars. There we go. Any other interest in this necklace? And if not, we are going to go once to Carly Q for two. Hey, Cajun, what's happening? Thanks for being here. We're going to go twice to Carly for two, looking for three. The last call. Fair warning. Sold to Carly for $2. Thank you, thank you. All right. Brain cramp. Okay, sorry. <laughs> um, this next piece I got for you is also a Leah Sophia. It's really, really pretty. We're just going to start it off at $3. The person that was trying to sell it, I don't know if they had it at a flea market or an antique booth. They were asking $40 for it. Um, I just left the tag there. Um, but there you go. It's a beautiful bracelet. It's got some abalone. It's got a nice purple um, stone there in the middle. Beautiful silver tone. And then it's got the toggle clasp on it. And I did see the Leah Sophia somewhere. Oh, Leah Sophia is marked on the back of that purple pendant. Uh, focus. There it is. <laughs> we got Laura coming in at three. Thank you. Thank you. Looking for that $4 bid. Beautiful, beautiful bracelet. The length on it is... Eight and a half. Eight and a half inches. There you go. It's got some weight to it. It's pretty heavy. Really, really pretty. Got the nice abalone. Nice toggle clasp. We got Carly Q coming in at five. We're looking for six. That little purple one in the middle there. It's just, it's beautiful. Laura is out. It is super nice. We got Carly Q at five. Um, Christy, did you want to come on in for six? She does. Christy's in at six and eight and a half inches long. And Carly Q, did you want to come on in for seven? Carly Q is out. So I finally found my glasses the other day. It's amazing how much better I can see. I can actually see my screen <laughs> standing right there. I was looking at the chat the other day. I'm like, I can read the chat from over here. Usually I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> we're going to go once to Christy for six, looking for seven. We're going twice. Now, if I can remember to wear them all the time, we'll be good. Last call. Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and we're sold to Christy for six dollars. Thank you so much. Hey Becky, <laughs> welcome everybody. Hey Becky, Christy asked, "Was that two or three? Were you counting?" <laughs> I was not. <laughs> that was two. Okay, I remember what I did here. This one's a really nice Heba tight uh, necklace. It'd be good for uh, a male or a female. I know. Even watching TV, it, man, it's hard. I have a 55-inch screen, and 
I can't like look through Netflix without squinting because I can't read the titles. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so this does not have a clasp on it. It is all hematite. So you get the hematite, probably eight millimeter beads here. And it comes on down. And this is not, let me double check. No, it's not magnetic. That's just how it's made. You got the rondelles, and then you got these three strands down here. I'll get you a length on it here in just a second. It's an excellent condition, nice hematite necklace. And hematite's not really, um, really cheap, so even if you wanted to buy this and just take it apart and repurpose it, make some earrings or, or something like that, bracelets, you're looking at 24 inches give or take half an inch or so. So you get 24 inches of hematite. There we go. You get all kinds of beads in these. And if there is no interest in this, we'll go ahead and pass it along. Not a problem. There we go. So we're going to go on over to this is me. <laughs> Done. <laughs> All right, everybody. This next one is going to start out at just a dollar. What we have here is some, um, it's a chain that has faux pearls and um, they have these little green like acrylic beads that are encapsulated, um, you know, caged in those pearls. Really, really pretty. I'll take it off the board so you can see it. This is starting out at just a dollar. It is pretty long. I can measure it if anybody is interested in that uh this one you could uh very easily double but i love how it's got that like it's almost like a um peridot color uh bee that's encaged in those pearls oh really pretty and it's long let me measure it for you because i know it's over 20 inches we're gonna measure it it's like oh yeah 30 inches um, so, I mean, you could, if you wanted to double it and it's very lightweight, like you won't even know you're wearing it. Only a oh, one on this. super pretty. Any interest in this? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it. All righty. Uh, my next one is going to be a lot, and we're going to start it out at three. It's got four pieces to it. Um, these are all going to be shell necklaces on the shorter end. Um, so we're going to start out with this one. Uh, we got this style here, which is pretty uh, unisex in nature. It's got the uh, shell um, tissue beads mixed in there um, with the wood. So you've got that one, and it's got the barrel clasp. That's number one. Number two is um, the pink rough shell there. That is a standard one. You see lots. So you've got that one. You've got um, this next one. It's a, uh, a smaller one, but this one has stones. We have, um, looks like um, hmm, red agate and possibly adventuring in there. So you've got stone chips here. That's your third one. And then your fourth one is just um, the standard he, she beads right here with the barrel clasp. You get all four starting at three. All right, uh, uh, man, I sound like a robot. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Let me turn that down. My mic, see if that helps. I'll talk a little bit lower, too. <laughs> <laughs> Any interest in this for a three dollar start? You get all four, you get shell and stone. All right, just let me know if you change your mind. We're gonna move on. Uh, for my last piece, uh, we're gonna start out at a dollar, why not? Um, this is one of those open cuff bracelets. 
Ooh. And it's got these pretty rhinestone encrusted uh, little arrowheads down here. And this is all done in that rose gold tone. Um, I love it. It's really cute. Um, these open cuff bracelets have come back. I mean, I see them everywhere. And um, these ones are really pretty with those encrusted rhinestones. And uh, rose gold tone. I tell you what, you don't see rose gold nothing anymore. You don't come across. Right. You got Laura coming in at one, looking for that two dollar bid. I will measure the opening. I didn't do that before, but I know that's important. Um, the opening is um, one and a quarter, so it's smaller, but it does bend. Um, you know, to accommodate your wrist. It's uh, bigger on mine. My wrist is a six and a half. Um, this could easily fit a seven, seven and a half wrist. All right, we got Laura for two. We're gonna go once a Laura for a dollar. We're gonna go twice. Last call, fair warning. And you sold to Laura for one dollar. Congratulations! Thank you. And that's my three. You got it. Alrighty. This one is going to be a yep, one dollar start, and it's silver tone. You got the lobster claw clasp back here with the extender, and it's super long. And now, oops, it's got this big old lobster claw clasp, and that is marked uh, BB, and then it comes on down to this heart. That has rhinestones on one side, and the other side is marked uh, BB. And then you got another heart that says BB on it, and then another heart that does. They all say BB, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. They all say BB. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but there we go. You got Carly Q in at uh, one. We're looking for two. So you could always take this off if you wanted to and use these as uh, pendants for a necklace if you want or whatever whatever you feel like doing. You can make three separate ones. We got, hi, Gypsy Queen. Gypsy Queen's in at two. Baby. Ah, that sounds better. <laughs> <laughs> we got Gypsy Queen in at two. We're looking for three. We got that big old lobster claw clasp down here holding this piece. We got Carly Q in at three. We're looking for four. There's the top of it there. You got that oval gypsy queen in at four. We're looking for five. So everything down here says baby. Baby. Carly Q's in at five. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop. Stop. We're looking for six. And gypsy queen is out. All righty. So we're going to go once to Carly Q for $5. Looking for that $6 bid. Going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold the Carly Q for $5. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Carly Q. And then what we're going to do. Sarah Coventry, we're going to do a $4 start. There we go. Uh, where's the clasp? There it is. Okay, so this is a nice bracelet. It is marked Sarah Cove. And it's got the fold-over clasp. And then this bracelet has all kinds of stones. So you got uh, rose quartz, possibly adventuring. You got this brown one here. I'm not 100% sure what it is. You get a little piece of amethyst. I'll get you a measurement here in just a second. You got pyrite, some more uh, milky quartz, clear quartz, opalite, um, maybe like a rough agate, another uh, another agate piece here, and I'm not sure what that one is. That one could possibly be um, amethyst as well, and another quartz. You got Laura in at four. We're looking for five, and let me get you a measurement, and then I'll show it to you a little bit better here. Here we go. This is what the back side of it here looks like. You got Gypsy Queen in at five. We're looking for six. Really pretty. 
Um, I'm, I think it's vintage. You're looking at um, seven inches, so it is a bit shorter. But uh, the phone here, I'll show you all the stones on it. There you go. Super pretty. Sarah Coventry. We got Gypsy Queen at five. We're looking for six. Love that opalite one. That one's so cool. I was just going to say that opalite sets it off right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It pops. And Laura, did you want to come on in for six or are you out? Laura comes in at six looking for seven. Nice Sarah Coventry. Is it just me losing the audio? Uh oh. Yeah, let us know if you're having a hard time hearing us and uh, we can make some adjustments. We got Gypsy Queen at seven, looking for eight. Super, super pretty. Laura's in at eight. Laura's fine. Judith, audio is good here. I hear you both fine. Okay, cool. <laughs> that makes me happy. Gypsy Queen is out already. Whoa, almost lost you, buddy. We're going to go once to Laura for $8. Looking for that $9 bid. Going twice. Last call. Fair warning. I guess it's just me then. <laughs> We're so the um, Laura for $8. Thank you, Laura. <laughs> and give me just a second here. $8. Okay. Let's do... What are you? You are tangled. That's what you are. No. Okay, we got it. What are you? This is... I'm going to say that's acrylic... We're just gonna do a uh, one dollar buy it now. Hey, David! First dollar gets it. So you get the twin clasp here, and they are lobster claw clasp. You get the gold tone chain, and it comes on down to this little uh, acrylic blue bead here, blue stone. Looks like a stone, but first dollar gets it if there's any interest. It's a nice, pretty acrylic bead. You got it, Gypsy Queen. Ah, it's yours. Thank you so much. Alrighty. And that was my three, so we're going to go on over to Dawn. Here we go. <laughs> All right. All right. I have some uh, Tiger's Eye Dangle Earrings. Uh, these are going to start out at $3. Uh, really, really cute. They are longer. And... Uh, Right here, yep, yeah, let me get him. <laughs> He's going across and he keeps wanting to jump on my lap. Um, right here we have some um, acrylic beads and we also have some tiger eye chips in there. Not sure if you can see them. It's done in this uh, kind of like um, brassy tone metal there. And we're starting out at three. Like I said, there's real uh, tiger's eye chips in the dangles. All right, guys, looking for that $3 start on this beautiful tiger's eye chip necklace. I uh, got necklace earrings. Just kidding. <laughs> looking for that $3 start. I hear a big, we hear a lot of noise upstairs. I'm gonna see if my husband's okay. Hold on one second. Okay. Oh. <laughs> All right, we will pass on that one. Um, the next one is um, just some heart earrings, stud earrings. We're gonna start out at a dollar. It's um, kind of like uh, white enamel with some. Um, Rhinestones encrusted across there, starting at a dollar. Just cute little studs. All right, let's start on this. 
Miguel says, are you okay? I'm okay. All right. <laughs> Any interest in this, you guys? Looking for that $1 start. We got 27 people here. Thank you. All right. If there's no interest in this, we'll go ahead and pass it. Okay. And then for the last one, we are going to do choice of. Starting at three, it's going to be on um, two different stretch bracelets. And um, these bracelets are um, really, really cute. This first one is a uh, stretch um, flower bracelet. It's got the um, lemony yellow. It's got the clear and the black toned uh, flowers. They are faceted. The petals are really, really cute. That's choice number one. Choice number two is also black. Um, I think, um, I don't know if it's really flowers or just maybe supposed to be not really butterflies either. I'm not really sure. Uh, but they do have the rhinestones and the black on this one, and it is stretchy. Uh, so you do get your choice on the flowers or the other one. We'll call the other one butterfly uh, just for the sake of giving it a name. <laughs> So if anybody's interested, yeah, I love this chunky one. All right, so we're going to start. Winner gets their choice. We got Laura coming in at three. I'm looking for that four dollar bid. Any other interest in this? And if not, we're going to go once to Laura for three. We're going twice. Last call. If you want to come on in for four, now's the time. And you're sold to Laura for three dollars. Congratulations. Which one would you like or would you like both? And she said both. Thank you so much. All right. And that was my three. Cool, dude. Hey, hey, we're going to do another $1. Buy it now. You get the lobster claw clasp bear, silver tone. You got the extender. And it comes on down to this cute little, is it a Hello Kitty? It's not marked, but you get the kitty with the bow tie. It is sl a slider. Super cute little pendant there. Be great for a little stocking stuffer for the young one. And Carly Q, you got it. It's yours. Thank you. Thank you. There it is. Hello. So we are sold. Carly Q. All right. And let's do. Yeah, we'll do this one. You are. Glass. All right, we're going to do another one dollar buy it now. All right, silver tone uh, lobster claw clasp with the extender. You got this black cord, so you're basically buying it for this little glass piece right here, which I put on backwards. So I'm just going to go like this. First dollar gets this one, and it's a nice purple color, like purple and silver. Not silver, that's just my hand. Hello. Purple and clear. And then on the back side. Here we go. Oh, no, it's like a copper color on the inside. Sorry, guys, I'm just crazy. It's cool. It's a <laughs> copper color. <laughs> hey. <laughs> well, it is Wacky Wednesday. Exactly, exactly. Well, at first thing, it's matching my skin, so it must be clear. No, no, it's not. <laughs> And Laura, you got it. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> oh, Lordy. <laughs> Bamos. Alrighty. And then for my third piece, what are you? All right, well, we're going to do another $1 buy it now. You're very welcome. Let me put sold so we don't get confused. And then we're going to do this. There we go. So this one, lobster claw clasp, does not have the extender. 
And you got the silver tone chain, and it comes down to, let me make sure all the little stones are there. And they are to this little pendant right here. Almost like a, like a whale's tail or something. It is silver tone on the back. First dollar gets it if there's any interest. And if not, go ahead and throw a pass. Just kidding. David comes in at one. You got it, David. Thank you. And that was my three. You ready, Don? I am ready. Let's do it. All right. I have a set of genuine scarab earrings. Uh, these are post back and these are brand new. Um, I'm going to start out at just $5, guys. Uh, you can see the carved uh, beetles right there. That's what scarab uh, jewelry is. It's got little carved beetles um, for the stones. And um, yeah, this is really, really cute. Those are awesome. Hi, right, Lisa. You got Laura coming in at five, looking for that six dollar bid. So, what's genuine scarab like? Is it like a certain stone that they use, or um, they use stones usually. Like this one is stone, um, but usually they um, use stone or uh, shell or you know, just whatever, whether it's glass or whatever. I've seen scarab um, engravings on all different stones. Um, but it's Egyptian revival. Um, beetles were significant in the Egyptian um, oh. um, culture. I'm trying to look for the word culture. Yeah, this is what I'm trying to look for. And so, uh, yeah, they, they're really significant to the Egyptians. Oh, okay. Cool, dude. We got Laura at five. We're looking for six. Hey, Sugar Plum. Any other interest in this? And if not, we are going to go once to Laura for five dollars. Looking for that six dollar bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And you sold to Laura for five dollars. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Okay, um, my next one, we're gonna go ahead and break out the sterling, I think, on this one. Uh, this one is a size eight ring, and um, I do not know what the stone is. It could be diamond, it could be CZs, it could be, uh, you know, white sapphire, I do not know. I'm gonna start this out at 25. What we have is a little butterfly with, like I said, some kind of stone. And then, uh, here, let me turn it. Then you have a second butterfly right there. And that second one um, is like the polished metal. And it is stamped. Let me show you. Find. Here it is. 925 right back there. So let me get this on my finger here. I'll take off my ring so you guys can really look at it. It is a size 8. All right. It's All right. Filling silver ring, size 8. Looking for a $25 start on this. Like I said, I'm not sure. You may get lucky. I don't know uh, what the stone is there. If it's, um, you know, zircon or if it's white sapphire or diamonds or CZs, I don't know. But you may get lucky. Who knows? That's right. You never know. It's got a nice thin band for those of you that don't like the real thick, heavy ones. This would be great uh, for Christmas uh, for a teenager, I think. Really, really cute. Absolutely. All right. We'll move on. And um, for my last one, we're just going to do a buy it now. This is a wood um, necklace here. It is barrel clasp. Let me get it together, guys, because 
kind of harder when it's separated like that. Um, this is a smaller um, wooden beaded necklace. It's just a buy it now for a dollar. It does have the um, barrel clasp right there. Um, I'm going to measure it because it is a dainty one. It's not long at all. Uh, this one is, yeah, 15 inches. Hey, buddy. <laughs> just passing through there. Okay, so there it is. Just the first dollar. I will take it. Hey, Moon Goddess. Hello, hello. One dollar buy it now. First dollar gets us. Any interest in this? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it. All righty. That was your three? That was my three. All righty. Hello, hello. We're going to do a one dollar start on this. And what it is. You got this uh, gold tone chain with the extender. You got a black string there. I can cut that off. I just didn't do it yet. Um, there you go. And then it comes on down to this really pretty pink. Uh, these are all acrylic. But nonetheless, it's a very pretty pink. And there's no tarnishing anywhere. There is what the chain looks like. If I can get it to focus. There you go. That's the chain on it. <laughs> Any interest in this for a one dollar start? It is unmarked. I think I'm holding it the right way. Maybe it goes this way. I don't think it really matters, does it? We'll figure it out. This looks better. Here we go. Well, maybe it looks the same. <laughs> Any interest in this? Looking for that one dollar start. Working and lurking. There you go. <laughs> All right, guys, if there's no interest in this, I'm going to go ahead and put it over to the side. Not a problem. We're going to do another $1 start. Okay. This is a nice long silver tone necklace. It's unmarked. You get the lobster claw clasp here, and you get all the silver tone discs. I'm going to go ahead and put it on this guy here. I'm going to double it up at the top, though, make it a little bit easier. There we go. So it is doubled up, so it is quite long. David comes in at one. We're looking for two. And David, you're coming in for one on the silver tone. Is that correct? Just want to make sure. I got one dollar. We're looking for two dollars on this. Any other interest in this necklace? And if not... We're going to call it to David for a dollar. We're going once. Looking for that $2 bid. That was for the pink one. Got you. All right. That one's going to be sold to you. Not a problem. All right. So if anybody wants to come in for a dollar on the silver tone one, that one is still available. Okay. Let me just do that real quick. All right. I got you, David. Thank you. Any interest in this for $1? <laughs> At that price, both. <laughs> okay, you got it. <laughs> so we're we're going to go once to David for a dollar on the silver tone one. Looking for that $2 bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And we're sold to David for a dollar on the silver tone one as well. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Oops, I gotta take you off of here. And we're gonna do a let's do a three dollar start on this one. So this one is quite long. You got the gunmetal uh, lobster claw lobster claw clasp here and the chain, and it comes on down to some red stones, a blue stone. I'm really not sure what the stones are, so I'm going to go ahead and double it up. I have a lot of wives. <laughs> you treat them all really good too, David. <laughs> um, I'm really not sure what these stones are on here. but they're That's really awesome, David. <laughs> he works in a nursing home. That's awesome. Uh, he's, he always buys them jewelry. He's so sweet. You got that dark blue one down here. It is, it's not lapis. So it doesn't have any uh, gold flecks in there. You got this one that could possibly be like a 
a carnelian, maybe. And then you get this other stone. It's kind of like a dark brown. And then it has a little bit of like a lighter green at the top. I'm not sure what that would be. That looks agate to me. Agate, okay. Yep. And then you get this blue one here. And then you get the little red ones at the top. Those may just be glass beads, but I'm not 100% sure if I can get it to focus. We got Laura at three. We're looking for four. Sorry, I was packing some more. What? Then I just got Peter packages, guys. We'll be going today. All right, there you go. Yeah, I'm going to go tomorrow. I was going to go today. Then I learned it was Veterans Day. <laughs> Which I feel like I knew when I woke up and I forgot. <laughs> All right, we got Laura at three, including mine. Sweet. We're looking for four. Yours went out yesterday, Lena. Carly Q comes in at four. We're looking for five. So I wish I could tell you what all these stones are, but I cannot. But I did dig out my crystal handbook. It's right next to me, and uh, I'm going to be digging in, into that hopefully today and making notes of all my stones that I have. Yeah, Carly Q at four. We're looking for five. It is awesome, Laura. And Laura, did you want to come on in for five or are you out? She's coming in for five. All right, looking for that $6 bid. Yep. Guys, if you have not subbed to Dawn yet, uh, she just dropped her link in the chat. Go ahead and subscribe to her. She does auctions on her channel too. And I also got her link in my description area as well. We're going to go once to Laura for $5. Looking for that $6 bin. We're going twice. Last call. And we're sold to uh, Laura for $5. Thank you, Laura. Appreciate it. Alrighty, that was my three. We're going back over to Don. Here we go. Alrighty. Thank you so much, Tiff. Yeah. Uh, this one's going to start out at a dollar. This one is a nice chunky um, chain that has this unusual pendant. It's got the black, um, like, faux stones in there. You've got a oval one that's fully faceted. You've got a top one here that has a heart shape. And then you've got, like, marquee cut over on this side. Just um, all different shapes on the stones. And then you've got the uh, rhinestone in the middle. And there's the back. Just a, a chunky silver tone chain on this one. That's really pretty. Yeah, $1 start on this. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Any interest in this for $1? I thought this was would kind of go with those uh, bracelets, too, yeah. uh, that I showed earlier, just because of the black and, you know, kind of like the floral shape. But this one, they just, I guess, put a lot of um, shapes together. Hey, Carol. All right, y'all. There's no interest in this. We'll go okay. ahead and pass this guy. This next one is going to be a lot of three, and I'm going to start out at three. Um, it's these three stretchy bracelets with the black um, stones right there. They're not real stone, just the, I don't know, rhinestone crystals. Very pretty. Very pretty. Very pretty. Things. Any interest in this three dollars start? You get all three of these guys. All right, y'all. There's no interest in this. We're gonna go ahead and pass it. Okay, and then my last one is gonna start out at a dollar. It's these cute uh flower earrings. Once again, kind of matching all this black I'm showing. <laughs> they would match perfectly with that bracelet and that necklace. Oh, yeah. Now, these ones, you can definitely tell they're flowers. Now, they do have the lever back, which is nice uh, for those ladies that um, maybe it's, uh, you know, windy where you're at. And lever backs, you know, they won't, they won't fly out of your ears. 
<laughs> Carol said, oh, brownie Carol. Points, that sexy top. <laughs> I better get those brownie points, Carol. Otherwise, <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's great. Uh, Only a one dollar start on this. Beautiful earrings. Here's the back. I'll show you the back to them too. Oops, <laughs> going the wrong way there. Yeah. Alrighty, that is my three. All right, sounds like a plan. Here we go. Hey, hey, we're gonna do a one dollar start on this as well. This is lobster claw clasp. This is like a, a unisex necklace here. You get the silver tone and the black in there. You can, if you have a, a nice pendant to put on here, you can. You don't have to have a, a bigger bail on it. Um, but you can most definitely put a pendant on here. Uh, David, how, I mean, not David, Don, how often do you invoice? David wants to know. I invoice once a week and it's on Monday. Thank you, Carol. I found my glasses and I can see again. Hey, <laughs> this is in really good condition. Just a $1 start. It is unmarked. It is pretty lightweight. And the black pieces are probably, I'm guessing they're acrylic. All right, y'all, there's no interest in this. No worries. I'm going to go ahead and put it over to the side. And we are going to, ow, I poke myself. Okay. How's this work? This is a clasp? Oh, it's a magnet clasp. I understand. Okay, so <laughs> we're going to do a $5 start on this. This looks to be like soda light. And so this is a clasp on it, and it is a magnet clasp. And if I can put it back on the right way. Oh, there you go. Nice and easy. So there's that. So you get the soda light chips, and it comes on down to these soda light pieces down here. And I got it backwards. Shocker. I would have it backwards. Yeah, there we go. So full of natural stone. Beautiful soda light. There's no gold tone flex in there. No gold flex in there. So this is definitely soda light. You get the blue and the white. Looking for that $5 star. You get the silver tone in between. Bring it up closer for you. There you go. Any interest in this for $5? And if not, I'll go ahead and pass that aside as well. Not a problem. Maybe I'll take it apart and do something else with it too. Those beautiful stones. So we're going to no sale that. And then let's do... We'll do this one. $5 start. And what this is, it's a nice bracelet. You get the three strands. You get the hematite cubes. And then you got rose quartz in there as well. And then here is the clasp on it. I don't know the term for this type of clasp, but it's one of these. It just hooks like that, and that is all you do. And that's awesome. I've never seen a clasp like that before. Me neither. It's super cool, though. Daniel is doing so good. He's getting so big. He's trying to talk more, and he's just, he's fun. Get the, I love the hematite cubes. They just catch that flash, and they're so pretty. Um, their length on this is, let me tell you. You're looking at seven inches on this one. So rose quartz and hematite. Any interest in this bracelet? We got Laura in at five. Thank you, thank you. We're looking for six. Hey, 710. Is the back of this blue? Mm, kind of. Really, really pretty. I don't know if that's going to help at all. I'm trying to show the rose quartz. Yeah, it helped a little bit. We got Laura in at five. We're looking for six. And if not, any other interest? We are going to go once to Laura for five dollars. Looking for that six dollar bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And we're sold to Laura for five dollars. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. And 
that was my three. So we're going to move back over to Dawn. Here we go. Okay, I have a size six and a half costume ring. Uh, we're just going to start this out at a dollar. It's a big, huge heart that has the rhinestones on it. It's uh, that brass um, tone metal. And we're starting at just a dollar. There is a little bit of weight to this ring. Exactly, David. I totally understand. We got, we're looking for that $1 start on this, size six and a half. We got yeah, Laura. that's understandable, David. We got Laura coming in at one. We're looking for two. Any other interest in this? Looking for that $2 bid. And if not, we're going to go once to Laura for a dollar. We are going to go twice. Last call. Fair warning. And we're sold to Laura for a dollar. Congratulations, Laura. Thank you. Okay. Uh, the next one is going to be a costume ring also. Uh, this one, we're going to start out at five. It is a size eight. And this one has a cute little frog um, that's got multicolored rhinestones on its body. Really, really thick on this one. He's a cutie. You got Laura coming in at five, looking for that six dollar bid. Got blue eyes. Let's see if I can. You got five dollars, six dollar bid, size eight. All right, y'all. We're gonna go once to Laura for five, looking for six. Well, we're going twice. She said frog. <laughs> Last call. <laughs> Sold to Laura for $5. Congratulations. Thank you so much. All right, Lena. We'll see you later. Oh, no. Bye, Le Lena. Levetta, you came in just a little bit too late. I'm sorry. I'll slow it down a little bit. Okay. Uh, my next item is earrings that are going to start out at a dollar. Uh, these are these hoop earrings, uh, metal. They are a little bit weighty, and um, they're stamped out with that uh, funky design. That's what it looks like straight on. All right, $1 start on this guy. Nice pair of silver tone earrings. Aw, walking your Frenchie. Cute. You must be happy. Or she. <laughs> <laughs> Any interest in these earrings? Then if not, we'll go ahead and pass these guys. Alrighty. That's my three. Alright, here we go. Hello, hello. I got this super cool brooch. Like... It's killer. So anyway, we're going to do a $4 start. I thought it was. I'm not sure if there's any spider people here. But it is unmarked. Whoa, almost dropped it. You got that abalone uh, body here. You got rhinestones on half the legs. And you get the black little eyes. It says a, it's not huge, but it's a pretty good size. And this is the back size, side of it here. And we got Lavetta in at four. We're looking for five. This is it's it's an excellent condition too. No tarnishing, nothing like that. So at its tallest, it from the tip of its uh, front leg to the bottom is about two and a quarter inches. So we got Laura at a high bit of five. We're looking for six. Carly Q comes in at six. We're looking for seven. If I can get this to focus, there we go. I'll hold it just like that. So about two and a quarter inches long. Got that inlaid abalone there. Super, super cool looking. 
We got Laura coming in at seven, looking for that $8 bid. Hey, Susan. Thanks for being here. We got Susan at eight. We're looking for nine. So Susan was the first one at eight dollars. That's right, Aaron. We got an auction. Laura is out. Um, Lavetta or Carly Q, did you want to come on in for nine or are you out? We got Susan at a high bit of eight. Really, really pretty. Lavetta is out. Got some nice flash on that. Carly Q comes in at nine. Thank you. Thank you. If it wasn't so pretty, I wouldn't be able to hold it. <laughs> I would have tossed it in a, in a jewelry jar. <laughs> Susan comes in at 10. We're looking for 11. It's unmarked. I mean, I've, I've come across a lot of brooches in my day, and uh, I've never seen one this cool looking. Um, it is. It, it's it's it is. beautiful. I never said a spider was beautiful before, but this spider is gorgeous. <laughs> so we're going to go once to Susan for 10, looking for that $11 bid. We're going twice. Last call. <laughs> we're sold to Susan for uh, $10. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right. And then let's do... Get out of my way. Okay, cool. <laughs> so I got another brooch. We're going to do a $2 start. Uh, winner gets choice. Yeah, okay. The first one I'm going to show you, I'm, I'm just going to show you two. Silver tone. You got the pretty flower. You got the blue stones in the middle there. I don't see any missing stones. It is unmarked. It's uh, significantly, significantly heavier than that spider I just showed you. So it's definitely a different uh, type of, of metal. And then the second brooch is Felix the Cat. This is 1988. Oh my gosh, how cute. <laughs> Felix the Cat Productions. It's so cool. So this one is definitely vintage, 1988. There it is. I had a Garfield one like this that I sold the other week. Carly Q comes in at two. We're looking for three. Winner gets their choice on these. My brother wanted to be Felix. <laughs> Any other interest in this? And if not, we're going to go once to Carly Q for two. Looking for that $3 bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold the Carly Q for $2. Congratulations. Which one would you like? Would you like both? You get the flower or Felix. Felix, you got it. And if anybody wants that flower, just let me know. All right. And then for my third piece... Excuse me. Um, let's do. Let's do. Oh, this one. Come to me. All right. David, you want the sunflower? You got it. Thank you. Thank you. And David, whenever I ship your stuff, I'm gonna get you a a bag full of stuff for the ladies on me. I'll just throw it in with your stuff. I will not forget because every time I see you, I remember. So when I see your invoices paid, I'll I'll remember. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do a five dollar start on this. This is soapstone. It is a small carved little squirrel. You got blue eyes, little soap soapstone squirrel. 
It is a lighter color soap, so it kind of got like the gray down here, and then it's a little bit more tan up on the top of the head. I'm not sure if, if the camera is portraying that, but you can see the detail in its tail, the little whiskers. You're so welcome, David. No problem. I'll put a, a little grab bag of wearable, wearable jewelry in there for you. Help you out with your store for them. Hey, Patty Teague. We got Patty Teague coming in at five. We're looking for that $6 bid. Peru. He's a cutie. He won't eat your linens or anything like that. Won't mess up your house. You know, he sits nice and still. We got $5 looking for $6. Any other interest in this cute little guy? And if not, we are going to go once a Patty Teague for $5. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. And we're sold the Patty Teague for $5. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. All righty. That was my three. We're going back over to Don. Bam. All right. I got to buy it now here. I've got a wooden um, beaded necklace. This is going to be buy it now for $1. Really lightweight once again. Uh, kind of the wooden he she beads done in the blue and the natural. It is a uh, barrel clasp. This is um, a new piece, I believe. Very pretty. I love those colors. Yeah, it's a little bit different of a wooden necklace. Usually you don't see the blue. Get that beachy vibe. All right, first dollar gets it. Any interest in this? One dollar, buy it now. All right. Just let me know if you change your mind. We're going to go on to the next one. The next one is a um, man's necklace. And this one's pretty weighty. We're going to start out at $3. It's got um, the black um, rondelles in between all that metal. And like I said, it is pretty weighty. Hey, Jewelry Center. And she says, Don, you're rocking that red. Love that color on you. Oh, thank you so much. This is a shorter one, about 16, uh, 15, 16 inches, I would say, on this one. I can measure it, though, if you want an exact measurement. Lobster claw. Like I said, it is weighty. Any interest in this? $3 start. Nice his or hers necklace. All right. And then for my last one, this is going to be a choice of, and it's going to start out at five. Uh, these are big, huge stone pendants. Um, I believe Howlite. And so we're going to show you these this is the first one it's um the stone is done in what's called trillion cut which is kind of like an upside down rounded uh triangular shape and it's got all the uh detail work around the bezel you got that thick uh big bale right there it also has detail work up at the top this is the back this is not 925 just so everybody knows this is silver tone. That's choice number one. Choice number two is even bigger. This one's huge. So you've got uh, kind of the teardrop shape to this. Once again, you got all that scroll work all around the bezel, all the way up the top of the bale. Same kind of bale on this one. Uh, you are going to want a thick, chunky chain on these. They are weighty. Um, so you Definitely don't want to do a dainty chain, otherwise you'll break it. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. They are real stone, real howlite, if you were wondering. Like I said, one's uh, a bit bigger than the other. So $5 start. Winner gets their choice. 
beautiful pendant. That would make a really nice necklace. Any interest in these? We'll go ahead and pass it. That was my three. All right. Oops. Okay. Back over this way. Hey. So we're going to do a $5. Uh, buy it now. Winner gets her choice. Hey, Patty Paws. Hello. Um, so these, are, I believe, are all soapstone. I got one, two, three, seven to choose from. And I'll go through them quite quick. And they're all smaller. So here's a skull. Get the darker colors on it. The second one to choose from, you get this light colored elephant. It's got yellow eyes. The trunk is up. If I can get it to focus, that'd be really great. There we go. Oh, shoot. I lost it. There it is. He's got his little tail in the back. He's a cutie. So Deanna came in first at five. I'll show you what else I got here. I got this little fishy. Nice detail. <laughs> he's uh, curved like he's uh, swimming. Fourth one is you got his little scorpion here. And again, these are all soapstone. You got a spider to choose from. There we go. You got a dragonfly. He's got, am I holding the right way? I am. Little dragonfly. He's got yellow eyes. And then the last one I'm going to show you right now is a little turtle. Turtle, turtle. So, Deanna came in first. Which one or ones would you like? Just uh, put the animal. I got a skull, an elephant, a fish, a scorpion, a spider, a dragonfly, or a turtle. Let me show the first one again. Absolutely. Come on. I'm trying to get it to focus for you. There you go. There it is. So there's the side profile. There's the front profile. Kind of a funky looking skull, but that's okay. I feel like you can almost like rest your glasses on top of him. <laughs> and then there's this part. That's the first one. You want that one? Done deal. You got it. And then Patty Paws was next, I think. Patty Paws and then Patty Teague. So, Patty Paws, which one would you like? Deanna. I got the elephant, the fish, scorpion, spider, dragonfly, or turtle. Elefante. Can I see them again? Absolutely. No problem. This one's a light color. Super cute. Trunk is up. He's got his cute little tail waving behind there. Um, and then you got this little fishy. You got a little scorpion. Spider. That fish is cute. <laughs> if you want that one too, let me know, Deanna. Oops. Ah, come back. Dragonfly. This one's a nice, like, uh, gray color. Green is gray. And then a turtle. There's a shell. He's a cutie. There you go. Those are the ones that are left. Okay, no problem, Deanna. So let me know which one you want, Patty Paws. Fish and the turtle. Fish, turtle. All right. And then Patty Teague, you are next. I got dragonfly, uh, scorpion, elephant, or spider if you're interested. So I got this one available. This one. This one. Or this one. If, and Patty Teague wants a scorpion. And then Laura Bamos. I got... Scorpion, elephant, or uh, dragonfly. If you are interested, let me know. They're all so cute. I've been going through a lot of bubble wraps as I've been selling these things. Selling stones. 
And if not, Laura, um, I, if anybody else wants some, you can just let me know. Thank you, thank you. Let me finish writing it down right quick. Five dollars. All right. So, I'll put these over to the side if you guys want them. The elephant, dragonfly, and uh, scorpion. We're going to do this guy right here. This one is super cool. This is an agate carved bear. He is uh, quite large. We're going to do a $14 start. He's super cool. So this is all agate. And it is a nice size bear. I'll get you a measurement on him. There we go. That's there. awesome. It's super cool. Oh, you said dragonfly. Sorry, I missed that. I got you. <laughs> There you go. I got you. I got you. Oh, I see it now. <laughs> Sorry. And there's the bottom of him. Super pretty. Uh, Where did my tape measure go? So from the nose to his tush, you're at about three inches. And then from the top of the back to the bottom of the front foot, you're at about two inches. This is agate. This is just a, a big old agate carved bear. He's pretty heavy, so he's about three inches long and about two inches high, give or take a quarter of an inch or so. $14 start on him. That's some beautiful detail. They, they even captured the way, like, the walking and the, this, everything. It's just really cool. Any interest in this guy right here? All right, I'll go ahead and put them over to the side if you decide that you want them. Just uh, send me an email or let me know in the chat, no problem. I think that, hey, Jen, I think that bead is onyx. This? Oh, the, the bear. Oh, maybe. I've been wrong before. <laughs> I'm getting my Presidium gem, gem Tester in uh, next week, so I'll have a better idea of what my stones are. It, it, hopefully it works well. I, I paid up for it. <laughs> I'll put it aside, you guys. Just kidding. Jonathan's at 14. We're looking for 15. I'm not sure if it's Onyx or Agate. I thought it was Agate, but I could be wrong. Yeah, I'm really excited to try it out. I still might not, not know exactly what it is, but at least I could tell you what it is on a Mo scale and give you an idea of what it is. Um, so we're going to go once to Jonathan for 14. Oh, you got it too? Yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait. I just ordered it like two days ago. They were out of them on Amazon, so I went to eBay, and I think it's the same seller they're just selling on um, eBay. We're going to go twice. Yep, it's definitely an investment, but I do this so much, it's it's definitely worth it. And we're sold to Jonathan for $14. Thank you. Thank you. All righty. And I think that was my three. So we're going to go ahead and go over to Don. Hey, Susan. Here we go. Okay, guys. Uh, my next piece is um, this cute... Uh, fold over class bracelet. It is a size eight. You have some um, acrylic pieces in there that look like uh, stone, but they are acrylic. Done in the silver tone, starting at $3. This is a size eight. There's the clasp right there. And it is not marked. All right, three dollars start. Really pretty silver tone bracelet. Any interest in this for three dollars? You said it was unmarked, is that correct? Right.
Hey, Jewelry Land Stephanie. Thanks for being here. All right, y'all. If there's no interest in this, we'll go ahead and pass it. Okay. Uh, the next one is going to start out at three as well. This is an enhancer. It's a cross. It's by Premier Design. I'll show you the mark right there at the bottom. And uh, that's what this is, is an enhancer. It's basically a pendant that you can uh, remove. It's a clip um, pendant is really what it is. It's nice and thick. It is weighty. I will tell you that. This is starting out at three. It is by Premier Design. All right, and that's Premier Design pendant. Three dollars start on this. Oops, there you go. Nice, beautiful gold tone, silver tone. Got that even nice design on the back. Any interest in this? Three dollar start. Okay, and then for my last piece, uh, this is going to start out at a dollar. This is one of those really long um, memory wire bracelets. It has all the. Um, dyed wooden beads to it. Really, really cute on this one. Only a $1 oh. You could use it to repurpose. Yeah, this would be great to repurpose. And I know a lot of people are looking for wooden beads. You got some of every color on this one. Really nice. Nice colors on that. Nice assortment. Only a $1 start. Yeah, David, that cross is really nice. All right, y'all. If there's no interest in this, we'll go ahead and pass okay. it. And that was my three. All right. So I got uh, some more stones coming your way here. We're going to do a $15 start on this. Let me turn up my light. It is really pretty. I'm going to try to catch the flash, but this is just a Labradorite stone. Super, super flashy. Almost at every angle it flashes. And it's just a big old Labradorite stone. I can get you a measurement um, height and width here in just a second. Really pretty. You can use it to hold and or you can use it as a, just decoration, or if you guys just a stone collection, there you go. You're looking at two inches by two inches, and it's about an inch, so like two by two by one-ish, something like that. A super flashy, really pretty Labradorite. Like even like in person, it's really, really cool. All right, get some flash there. Looking for a $15 start on this guy here. Yeah, once since I've been getting into stones, I, I just, I love them. Yeah, it's really, really nice. Oops, wrong way. I'm going to try to turn it up more. Jennifer's in at 15. I'm going to catch a flash without getting my ring light right on there, but <laughs> I'm feeling horribly. <laughs> But lots of flash on it, especially on this side right here. We got Jennifer at 15. We're looking for that $16 bid. Super, super pretty. There it is. Oh, nice. Awesome. Ooh, I'll turn that down a tidbit so I can see again. Even without the light, you can still see the flash. All right, y'all, if there's no other interest in this, we're going to go ahead and call it to Jennifer for 15. We are going once. We're going twice. Yes, tonight is Wednesday night, so Jennifer's got an auction at 8 p.m. Eastern on her channel. Uh, go ahead, drop the link if you want to, Jennifer. And Dawn, do you have an auction tonight, too? Yep. Drop that link. Dawn's got an auction tonight. What time? Uh, 7 
No, 6 p.m. 6 p.m. There you go. So we got a few options you can choose from tonight. And we're sold to Jennifer for $15. Thank you. Thank you. I need a bigger bag than that. <laughs> it is pretty. It's a stunner. All right. So. Bam. We're going to do $15 start. No, $14 start. Winner gets choice. And then I'm on with Scooter tonight at 10 p.m. Eastern. We're going to bring some clothes out tonight. Um, I believe these are both um, Susan of Tower are uh, these right here. Single points. This one happens to be uh, terminated quartz. But yeah, that's what a tower is. So, $15 start. Winner gets their choice. I believe they're both um, Bloodstone, I think. This one right here is more of a green and red. Super pretty owl. Got lots of detail. This one is like gray, white, and red. If I am wrong on the Bloodstone, um, please let me know. I am trying to learn, and it's not clicking quickly. <laughs> And I'll get you a measurement on it. $15 start. Carly Q comes in at $15. So the one that's gray and white is about two inches long, tall, and about inch and a half wide. And the one that's more green, same size. Same size. Bloodstone. Okay, cool. So are they both Bloodstone then, uh, Laura, Jewelry, etc., or anybody? We got Laura com Bameless coming in at 16, looking for 17. Jennifer just dropped her link for tonight's auction. They always have all kinds of nice stuff. So this one's more green, and this one's more gray. About two inches by an inch and a half or so. There's the back sides of both of them. We got $16 looking for $17. Carly Q comes in at $17. We're looking for $18. There's the tops of their heads. Really, really pretty. Laura is out. So we are going once to Carly Q for $17. Looking for that $18 bid. Going twice, y'all. Last call. Fair warning. And we're sold to Carly Q. Thank you. Thank you. Which one would you like? Or would you like both? One on the left looks like a Jasper of some sort. Bloodstone, definitely the one on the right. Okay, cool. Thank you, guys. Both in the Jasper, Chicago, Sydney, and Quartz family. Okay, cool. Thank you, guys. So I got you for the Bloodstone. And Bamos, would you like this guy for 15? You let me, um, 17? Let me know. Or anybody else. Appreciate it, you guys. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I want the one with the red. So I made a mistake then. Is, is this the one that you want, Carly Q? I'm going to hide this one for a minute. I made a mistake. <laughs> so sorry, guys. Yes. Okay, my bad. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. And then... uh. Laura, did you want this one then for, um, you want the other one? Okay, you got it. <laughs> Sorry about that. I was confused. Confuzzled. Um, there we go. I'll get there, you guys. I swear I will. Not today, but I'll get there. Uh, we're going to do a, well, I'll do another $15 start. So $15 start. This is a nice rose quartz skull. Carved skull. There we go. And it's a really good size. Quite heavy. He's going to at the top of a pyramid. Oh, cool, dude. <laughs> um, let me see if I could use the back of this. I thought I thought I thought the one with red was bloodstone. Laura, can you can you help us again? I, I, it is. So this one is the Bloodstone, and then this one is uh, the Jasper. OK. 
Okay. <laughs> I'm going to try to put it behind this book. It is. Okay, cool. That'll help out a little bit. Nice rose quartz skull. $15 start. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I forget how big around this is. Let me just get you a general idea of it. It's about seven inches around. And at its tallest point, you're looking at like two and a quarter inches tall. Looking for a $15 start. Any interest in this rose quartz carved skull? And if not, I'll go ahead and put it aside. If you decide that you want it, you just let me know. Alrighty, that was my three. So we're going back over to Dawn. Here we go. Bam. Okay, guys, I have a really long um, textured silver tone chain here. Um, we're going to start this out at five. It's got like uh, the textured disc, and then it also has the um, shiny disc links. And it's really long. <laughs> You're good. Um, it's this really long. Good. It's it's probably a good, I don't know, 40 inches, I would say, on wow. that chain. Uh, so it's super long. I can measure it if you want me to. That one's starting out at five. All right, a nice silver tone chain. Looking for that $5 start on this. Any interest in this? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it. Okay, the next one I have is a costume ring and um, this is a eight and a half, and I'm gonna start it out at $5 as well. It's kind of got like that pink ice look to it. It's got the big stone right there in the center, and then it's got the surrounding stones that kind of make it look like a flower. It's got a little bit of a split shank on it coming up to the bezel. You got a thinner band on this one. All right, five dollar right. start. Pretty costume ring. Beautiful silver tone. Get that beautiful stone in the middle. Size eight and a half. Any interest in this? All right, y'all. If there's no interest in this, we'll go ahead and pass it. Okay, and then the next one, um, I'm going to show a um, sterling silver bracelet. I will measure it. Um, we're going to start this out at 25. Uh, I did not clean it, as some people prefer me not to, so I just left as is. Um, so you might want to clean it when you get it. Um, this one is seven inches and it's a herringbone chain bracelet. Mm -hmm. It is marked and tested. It says made in Italy right there. <laughs> and then it's, it's stamped kind of everywhere. Says 925 Italy right there. All right. Nice right. drilling silver bracelet, seven inches long. <laughs> Note to self don't click links because you will get lost. <laughs> it is pretty. Any interest in this?
All right, guys, if there's no interest in this, we'll go ahead and pass it. Thank you. Thank you. Was that your three? That was my three. All right. You want to make this the last round on? Sure. All right. So this one is marked Leah Sophia. It is a bracelet. And we're going to do a $3 start on this. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So you got the really pretty mother of pearl. And you get some brown stones here. And you get the fold over clasp. It's in excellent condition. Uh, let me open it up. Maybe. And the Leah Sophia is, I just saw it. Where'd you go? Oh, right there. It's on the top one right here. There it is. Really, really nice. And then I'll get you a measurement on it as well. Very clean. It's pretty weighty too, it's heavy. Lazy Bone, Susan comes in at three. And you are looking at um, like a seven and a quarter is what you're looking at for the length on this guy. And there we go. We got $3 looking for that $4 bid. Beautiful Leah Sophia fold over clasp. You got like that brush texture there in the back. And you get the Leah Sophia over here on this one. We got Lavetta coming in at four looking for five. A smidge closer for you. And Susan is out. So we're going to go once to Levetta for $4. We can put that $5 bid. We're going twice. Oh, my husband wants that silver bracelet you just showed. Oh, does he? Okay. So, yeah, just, just bill me for it. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Last call. Pair warning. We're sold to Libetta for four dollars. Congratulations. Are you gonna make me something, Jose? <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. And <laughs> Woo -hoo, Jose. He's been chatting more. Usually he doesn't. Oh, yes, he is. Sweet. I'm excited. I'll show you guys what he makes. Well, me. you just got brownie points, Jose. <laughs> you sure did, buddy. It's going to be a <laughs> for you. <laughs> We're going to do a $1 start on this beautiful silver tone. There you go. You get a couple stones on there. You get the leaves and that beautiful flower. Um, so you get that. This is, yeah, this one's kind of faceted right here. And then this one is not faceted. It's kind of like a like a globe. Not globe, but a bubble. Jennifer comes in at one. We're looking for two. <laughs> Got the silver tone uh, clasp in the back. Got a wee bit of tarnishing, but not much at all. Just on the clasp part, though. Everything else is totally fine. There's the back of this guy. We got $1. Looking for two. We got David's life coming in at two. We're looking for three. It's that pendant is just, it's beautiful. Jennifer is out. So we're going once to David for two. Looking for that three dollar bid. We're going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold to David for two dollars. Thank you. Thank you, David. Appreciate it. All righty, and let's see, oops, for my last piece of today, for today, whichever way you want to say it, oh, that one's cool, let's do that one, so we're going to do a, you're very welcome, a $5 start on this. No, just kidding. We're going to do a $4 start. No, just kidding. We're going to do a $4 start. We'll get there. 
<laughs> wow, Tiffany. All right. So you get the lobster claw clasp here. It does have some tarnishing, but that'd be an easy little change. But you get all these uh, stone crosses on here. <laughs> um, this one's kind of uh, maybe possibly carnelian. This one might be unikite. I'm not sure. You got Jennifer in at three. You got rose quartz. You got a tiger's eye cross. Um, I think this one might be like a moss agate. Oh, this one's got blue stone. This one, this is a blue stone cross. David comes in at four. Love it's, blue stone. Oh, it's so pretty. Yeah. Uh, you got the Dalmatian stone right there. I think that's what that is. I'm kind of winging it. If I'm wrong, I do apologize. Um, I don't know what that one is. <laughs> and then that's about it. It is a shorter bracelet, though. It is kind of small. So we got David at four. Jennifer's at five. Really, really beautiful. <laughs> I'm shot at five. No, four. No, three. Uh... It is, yeah, it is shorter. So you're looking at seven inches from clasp to clasp. David is out. That blue stone is so pretty. I was going to show it one more time. Look at that. It's so awesome. I actually get a blue uh, stone sphere that I'll bring the next uh, auction. We're going to go once to Jennifer for $5. Looking for five, uh, six. We're going to go twice. It's super pretty. You can probably, if you, if your wrist is too small for it, just get like a little extender for it. Cause I could put it around my wrist, but it would be, it's not, it's not moving. It'd be staying right there. Oh, Christy comes in at six. We're looking for seven. There we go. Jennifer is out. Alrighty. Going once to Christy for $6. Looking for that $7 bid. Going twice. Last call. Fair warning. Sold to Christy for $6. Thank you, Christy. Appreciate it. Alrighty, that was my three. We're going back over to Dawn. Okay, I have a costume ring. It is a size seven and a half. And I am going to start this out at $3. This is a nice one. Uh, once again, Tiffany, you see a pattern. Uh, these black flowers. You yep. know, I've had a <laughs> lot of jewelry like this. I don't know what's in the air, but... Anyhow, uh, you got the gold tone going on with all these uh, different flowers. You got the rhinestone flower, the enamel white, the enamel black, and kind of this cluster formation. And uh, that one is starting out at three. All right, $3 start on this size, seven and a half. The black flowers are pretty. Yeah, and notice how this kind of matches all the other pieces that I had like this. It's really weird. You could have had the bracelet, the earrings, the necklace, and the ring. Yeah. <laughs> all right, y'all looking for that $3 chart on this. Really, really pretty costume ring. All right, we'll go on. Um, the next one is going to be a choice of, and these are um, alpaca bracelets. However, uh, they do not, that I see, have the markings. Um, and as you guys know, if you know anything about alpaca, when they stamp it, the stamp uh, tends to wear off really quickly. Uh, that's just how it is. I'm not sure why, but that's what happens. So this is going to be a choice of. Uh, we're going to start these out at 10. So the first choice is the butterfly done in abalone. And you've got the tension clasp to it where you squeeze and it comes undone. And this is the bigger one. I will measure the diameter because you're probably going to need to know that. Um, this one is about two and a half. And so there's choice one. Beautiful. Choice number two is the dragonfly. Once again, done in the abalone with the onyx body to it. This one is a bit smaller. Um, this one is mm, just past two and a quarter. 
So that's that one. And the third choice is the heart. Those are so pretty. Yeah, these are really, really cute. And like I said, this is just a choice of starting at 10. Um, this one's not quite two and a half. So you've got the heart, you've got the um, dragonfly, and then you've got the butterfly. I'm looking for a $10 heart. Winner gets their choice. These are all alpaca and abalone bracelets. Any interest in these? Really pretty. And if not, we'll go ahead and pass them. Okay. And then for the last piece, I just have this uh, stretch garnet bracelet that we're going to start out at three. It's a stretchy one. It's got like the red thread. In the middle, you can do a lot with these pieces of garnet right here. Oops. All right, nice stretch garnet bracelet. Looking for that $3 start bid on this. Those are pretty. Yeah. Any interest in this? And if not, we'll go ahead and pass it. All righty. All righty. Was that your three? Yep. All right, I'll bring myself up with you. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with us tonight. So there's going to be a lot of auctions going on tonight. Uh, Dawn's going on at 6 Eastern. Jennifer's going on at 8 Eastern. And I'm going on at 10 Eastern. Um, I'm doing some clothing, trying to clear house. So... You guys have a wonderful day. If uh, Dawn does not have your info, I will go ahead and get it over to her for you guys. So don't worry about sending her an email. You're good to go. Um, so we'll see you guys later. Bye, guys. Thank you. Thank you.